Hi everyone, we are back with another full self-driving video and we are in currently in Boston. Last week we tried full self-driving version 12.3.6 in Manhattan and we made three videos. Thank you so much for showing us so much love on that Manhattan video. But this time we are here in Boston. We just came here for just one day trip and we came in a ferry from New York and we are trying full self-driving unfortunately I forget to bring my outside camera but it is what it is guys at least you guys can see how the car performs here so the light is still red also guys if you guys are new in this channel make sure you subscribe to this channel for getting more full self-driving video update and also about Tesla Elon Musk and you know robot taxi so I'm just fixing my camera because the camera was a little loosened up so I had to tighten that camera and you know make this video. So still the light is still red and it just turns green but we have to definitely stop to you know get the people uh, move from in front of us and then we can make that left turn. So we'll see how the car handles this one. As you just can see, there is another car just making a left turn in front of us. And we also cross it here and we have to wait until uh, all the cars and humans are clear. So our car is stopped in the very first place. There was like two people walking up. But then when it realized that there is those people are not going to cross the road. So it just immediately make that um, lane change. Very, very nice and impressive, guys, right? and the yelled here i had to go forward to look on the left and left side because if there is any other car but the car since like didn't slow down uh didn't slow down at all like very interesting things because if there is any yell sign the car should slow down but probably because of that camera the car uh looked on the left side also if you guys notice there is that car was trying to park and our car just avoided that by just changing lane and move to the left lane and then come back again to the right lane very very human like driving because the car was seeing so far that that car is already stopped there and trying to park there so our car just changed the lane and park there very nice also the weather seems beautiful i really love the ferry ride over there uh from orient point to new london very very nice and like you know if you start in the very early morning you have to love this uh ferry ride very very nice so we're just proceeding in boston street and we're in downtown currently but it seems like the car is handling it very nicely compared to like Manhattan it's like less car less traffic less stress but as you guys can see the car is handling everything very nice here and there uh, the car is going from the right hand lane and you'll see there is a curve over there right the car is steering wheel just here the car slows down because this one lane merged into two and the car had to decide which lane I should keep in and the car decided to move in the left side because yes that's the right lane we should choose to go straight and this two lane merges into one so our car merged there perfectly and we are moving forward so in upcoming traffic we're gonna make a right turn and we'll see how the car performs over there right guys I'm just increasing the speed a little bit because it seems like the car is slowing down a little bit so and also there are other cars coming from our left side but the car doesn't have to slow down because there that is the yell sign they have to stop there right guys so we'll make a right turn here the car slows down very very nicely done there is no hesitation a little I, I always feel like whenever the car is making a right turn the car slows a little bit more than usual like as a human probably I would not slow down that much and also now you guys are noticing there are a few more car park in the road so we have to touch the yellow line and move forward right guys this is seems very narrow road because of those parked car like you like manhattan right guys so moving forward guys we'll see how the car handles this situation also guys if you guys are new in this channel make sure you subscribe to this channel because in this channel we're going to talk about full self-driving robo taxi elon musk and tesla right guys so we just start for this red light and we have to move forward after this level um we're gonna make a left turn here but 
probably uh, my GPS where I tried to go, uh, there was a mistake by me. Uh, so I had to fix this GPS issue and then we're gonna change the route here and there. And uh, let's see how the car handles this one. We have to wait here for this blue car pass so that we can make this left turn. The car is making that left turn perfectly. There is also, this road is also very narrow. And as you guys can see, our car, you know, like fixing the steering wheel by going, giving a little nag left and right here and there because it seems like the curve on the right hand side is very close to the road and our car is doing a little nagging of the steering wheel left and right. And we have to stop on this stop sign. Definitely the car tried to proceed here, but there is a human. I really don't know why the car uh, like moved a little bit and then it decided to stop. Um, still, um, you know, it's not a like very critical disengagement, but the car creeps a little bit, which I really don't like because when a human is passing, you shouldn't move. You should just stop there on the stop sign. So moving forward, we'll see how the car handles this situation. Let's go. So I'm gonna fast forward this section because I made a mistake choosing the destination where I want to go. So I took over because the car navigation is saying to make a left, but I really wanna go to a straight. So I just took over and uh, you know, I took over and then turn on the FSD again here. So as you guys can see, the car is started driving itself again. So we'll see how the car handles this situation where you'll see something very interesting coming up, right guys? Also guys, if you guys are new one more time, please make sure you hit that subscribe button because that's the only free way you can support me as a content creator like last one month i've been grinding i've been putting videos every single day most of the day i try to put long videos other than that i will just put some short so make sure you hit that subscribe button so as you can see the car is moving forward slowly there is this road seems very narrow but it is like there is no other car parked over there so as you guys can see we'll make a left here on this uh, green light, we'll see how the car handles this one. And uh, yeah, so the car is moving forward as you guys can see and immediately merges into this white line. We have to yell here, but there was no other car was coming from our right side. So the car decided to proceed very, very nice. Okay, so as you guys can see, we are moving forward probably as a as a human driver i would not stay in this lane because this lane seems any passenger can just open the door and that's why i'm just sitting carefully so that i can took over any time and also this lane specifically seems very narrow there's construction on our left side stores on our left side so the car is going a little slow now as you guys can see it is creeping very very slow trying to adjust the uh, position and there is also a car park double parked i would definitely have to mention that is double parked over there and there are a few other cars coming from our right side so there is like very little space but our car is very intelligent as you guys can see and there is a cop's car too but our car have to definitely change the lane and the car is doing it i i don't like the idea that car didn't turn on the indicator uh, it make a little room over there and immediately change a little lane and then again merge into over here. But the interesting part is there is another double parked car. So we definitely have to merge again on that right hand lane. And now this time there is a cop's car. So we'll see how the car handles this one. So I turn on the lane like right indicator so that people understand I'm going to change the lane and the cop's car just proceed and our car immediately change the lane very very nice job and again the car decided to just move into that left lane which i don't like for some reason because we have to go straight and now i just took over because there is no destination i put in the gps thank you for watching guys this is a very short video sorry uh, i'll definitely make some more videos on in new york there's like very short time i went there and i don't want to ruin the vacation over there so but I still tried some fsd in boston so hopefully you guys enjoy that video and make sure you hit that subscribe button and thank you for watching have a wonderful wonderful day